Hello and welcome everyone, Lonhart here with Mr. Smart Donkey. Hello. And we are back with the sock munching, <laughs> crooked moon and bloody hands. <laughs> we were very clever in that we never specifically specified a given amount of time in between episodes or when socks would need to be consumed. But we have heard you loud and clear, viewers, with your comments on all sorts of random videos, Total War and non-Total War alike, saying, hmm, socks do taste tasty, <laughs> or hmm, I wonder when there'll be socks, or hmm, socks, or just anything to do with socks. Fair play, that was the incentive, or not really incentive, but uh, deterrent. Counter incentive, on, yeah. <laughs> yeah, deterrent on, on making sure we finish this Let's Play and not letting a co-op fall by the wayside. I mean, the thing is, it's not a case of we didn't want to continue it. It's just both got super busy. Then Warhammer 2 came out. And it's one of those things, especially when, you know, when I don't have Donkey, like, s sitting next to me or living next to me that I can be like, yo, Donkey, come here. Let's, let's record more. But anyway, we are back. We are going to get this finished because, in, in part, we actually want to do another co-op or head-to-head or -head in the near future with Tomb Kings. But we don't want to start that until we finish this because it wouldn't be fair to you guys. So, the Donkey Lion is back. The Crooked Moon Bloody Hands is back. And we are picking things up. And we have no clue of what's going on. Yeah. We briefly had a quick skim through the last um, video we both uploaded. and um, Which was five months ago. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, Sorry, it's been a while. Blame, blame Warhammer 2 coming out, basically. Yeah. Um, but we are back, and we are actually... You won't see this video until we've record, binge recorded either all the way to the end of the campaign or until we're, like, a few episodes away. Just that way, you'll know that we've basically finished the campaign already. So by seeing this first episode, either we've recorded right to the end of this campaign and it's already done, or... We're, we've recorded like seven or eight episodes in a couple of sittings that are ready to go out to you guys. So it's not going to disappear again. It's going to be pretty consistent. Um, and there's going to be a lot of uploads or coming through. Or, for a choice, slightly near you soon. the next yep. video you'll, you'll see will be us eating socks. Yeah, yeah. Or, or there'll be a sock eating video soon. But I really don't want to eat those socks. Nope. Anyway, let's fight this battle. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Um, I do. I do remember. I didn't want to lose my infantry or my lord in this, so we're gonna have to probably shell them a lot with the artillery. Oh yeah. And then use the trolls because the trolls are fine. Some of the cavalry is okay, uh, but the infantry is pretty messed up. Good old blog. Blog. Yeah, man. I gotta gotta get used to this again. I mean, it's been a while since I played Warmer Two, but let alone Warmer One. This it's uh it's been ages. <laughs> I honestly, I just said to Leonard as I started the game, I, I had some notifications telling me about Norska and such. I was like, how long has it been since I've played this game? It has <laughs> been an, an awful long time, but here we are. Yeah. Also, uh, people watching this on my end, um, if Donkey isn't loud enough, let me know and I'll make sure I sort that out. Um, or at least yeah, I think, I'm, like, I think on my end, you're actually a little too loud, so I'll, I'll lower you after this episode. It's not too bad, though. Sorry. Right, um, I'm gonna give you all my cav. Yay. Um, and I'm just gonna, I'm gonna hide, well, I'm gonna stack up the infantry in a sort of a blob. I mainly just need the artillery just to fire at them. And then I need to just try and pin them with trolls a bit. Sounds like a plan. That That's, that's my only go-to here, because Blorg is pretty out of it as well. Yeah, they've got free, well, a general, or sorry, lord, and two agents as well, so that is definitely yeah, strength on their part. Vladdy Daddy, um, a uh, vampire lady, I don't know what she, she is, just a vampire hero, and a, oh, it's a vampire oh. lord hero, mounted. Fair enough. Oh no, he's a, is he a witch, is he a wraith? Uh... Isn't he like a white king or something? Is that white what king? That's the that's the thing. Man, I actually know something. This is miraculous. Yeah. I actually have a bonus versus large, so I could actually try and take him out at some point with some of the cav. Yeah. The uh, the missile troops are gonna not be fun. Uh, the missile troops, the flying troops, rather, are not gonna be fun. Yeah, I'll try and keep some cav around to deal with them as well. Or help. Yeah, I'm just hoping they them. just all just dive into my trolls. That would be good. But um, yeah. Dive into my trolls. 
Yeah, this is an interesting uh, setup because like they've got a whole bunch of crappy units, and then they've also got a couple of high tier units like the the Devils of Swatchhafen. Okay, their cav is coming towards me, so I'm actually gonna go in full in on this. At least they haven't got any range, which is good for us because your trolls will take a beating from ranged, but they haven't got any, yeah. so that helps. My trolls would not have much fun. Fix Reavers, I'm gonna try and send the trolls into them as well. Noise. Alright, while I'm engaged. Uh, trolls get back. Ooh, the other one's coming over to me as well, the Vargeist. Oh my Quick god. Trolls, turn around. Two minutes it's already routed. Uh oh. Uh oh. Your entire force is now coming over here. I can't remember how, how crucial of a battle this is. Let's <laughs> <laughs> uh, hope not too crucial. We yeah, still got a chance. Let's hope it's okay. I'm going to try and pull this cab out of here. We is better than them. That is the thing to remember here, guys. We is better than them. Oh no, my trolls are getting wrecked. No, don't get wrecked. No, get away from me catapo. Balance power is just shifting for them. But I have just taken out some of their flyers. Trolls getting over here. Save over Borg! Yet. Your lord is under attack. Oh, what a shot with the catapult. No! Blorg! Don't die! Blorg! Ooh, that would be bad. Oh, I see a lot of routing going on. Yeah, because I don't know if he can actually, like, survive and retreat out of this or not, really. Uh, oh, Blorg. My memory doesn't get go back five, five months, unfortunately. Ooh, this uh, Cryptorian is getting wrecked there. Almost. Yeah. I don't think it's going to be enough. The Vladdy Daddy surprise. It's not appreciated. Not at all. Yay, I killed a unit. I did it. No ways. Trolls, get back in there. Trolls, get back in there. <laughs> Smush them. Oh, you forgot. You, sh you hired some cravens again, didn't you? That's we as garbos. Oh, you can make that zombie unit. I'm trying to avoid it and kill other units, but yeah, maybe I should. Walk says do it. Oh no, I'm dying. Don't do Everything that. is breaking. No. Might I recommend trying not to die? It does sound like a good plan. What, what do I know? Um, We is the best. We got you over here, idle. Oh, come back. Swords. Come on, biggins. Oh no! My, all my stuff just routed. No! Oh dear. Blorg's gonna die. No, not Blorg. Blorg. Shove I have. Save Blorg. Hashtag Get save out Blorg. Of the, uh... Yeah. Oh, trolls will come back. Yeah, I seem to recall this is a battle that maybe we lost, and that's why they attacked us again, and now... If you lose this, your oh, army is yeah. gone. I'm not sure, but that's very possible. Oh, come on, we're crumbling. Zombies! Ah, screw you. Flying bats. Get back in there, cavalry. Trolls. In. Crush. Kill. We're definitely bringing it closer. Yeah. Uh, might be... I think they're going to they're gonna get us on uh, leadership. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about. Yeah, my units are just routing. Ripperoonie. Oh, come on, Trolls, going for one big last crush. Nope, there goes my last unit. Damn it. Yeah, there goes. The mass route is hitting. You're yep. losing ground. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm losing the battle is what I'm doing. One of my units is still somehow here. And gone. Oh, wait. There we go. There we go. All Valiant right. defeat. Blorg! No! No, not Blorg.
Rip blog. Oh, they lost so many more troops as well. I mean, most of them were zombies, to be fair, but still. That is rough. Man, those catapults did a number on the enemy. Is he dead? I don't know. Your loading screen is probably faster than mine. I'm waiting for players. <laughs> <laughs> that, that I think that's me. Sorry. A minute now. I'll find out his fate. Oh, God. The tension. Here we go. There we go. Ah, oh, Blorg's dead. No, Blorg. <laughs> oh, he was so close to the other army. Oh, for, yeah, like, you have an army right there. Damn it. That's unbelievable. Rip. Well, that army's going to get revenge immediately. No. Yeah, this is the thing. They had like a bazillion agents running around the place. Yeah. I've got my army at Zufbar. I can go in Drakenhof and wreck some faces. Yeah, my my memory of um of this faction of the uh, vampire counts seems to be that we had some quite a lot of trouble actually with them. We haven't really done too well against them for some reason or another. Yeah, I think we went in hard and then they've managed to split up our forces a bit. Yes. Ooh, I gained I'm a while. Okay, because I've got my wars hitting outside for Oversteyr, and I've got Snark Skarsnick about to come in there. You've got Skulk De Wise, who's looking in pretty bad shape. Oh god. Templehof. And I've got another oh, war okay. over there. Then who's over here? Oh, this is Gorfang Rock Gap. Yeah, he can wreck them there. But they're really on their last legs, though, because I've got... Okay, Muzrub is in the mountain, so he only needs, like, a turn or two. All oh, right, yeah, we need. We were going to get both of our armies together to attack Drakenhof, I think, because we said we'd, like... I think we said we'd fight that one, because it would be probably quite a big siege. Yes. But I think you need to... You've got to replenish up with Skulk the Wise. Yes. I'm actually going to... He can probably stay where he is, because... Yeah, I seem to recall maybe we were trying to get rid of Fort Oberstyre first. You were going to raise that or something. I don't recall. I was here for a reason. I'm in range of the town. So I think yeah. maybe that was something to do with the plan. Either way, I should probably go into raiding camp. That's for sure. I have a level up and I'm not sure what to put in. Let's just go health. Why not? Safe bet. Um, yeah, because I could attack Fort Oberstyre right now. But I yeah. don't know if that was a plan or not. My army's pretty... I, I don't really want to risk losing any units. So I probably should just encamp. Just... just just yeah, just replenish up for now because I've got my War there and I've got Skarsnik who can definitely take out Fort Oberstire. Yeah. And then once we're should you, uh, and Templehof can actually fall pretty quickly as well. Do you want to camp next to Templehof then, so we can attack that one next turn? Yeah, yeah. As long as you've got enough movement to get near it and encamp. Yes. All right, we'll do that. Raiding camp. Oh yeah. Noise. Okay, not particularly great replenishment, but right, let me refresh my memory on my Oof. armies. I, as I could be recruited in Ekrant, that's going to be done full stack next turn. Had this army near Karak Izor, which is going to Karak Izor for some reason or another. Not sure why. I have Peace <laughs> of the Talaeans. This army here, I guess you're going to try and get Karak Bufbar back again? Sure, can you jump over there? No, you can't. Sorry, run over there then. Oh, yeah, well, I've got Ugo over there, haven't I? With this army. I think I was bringing... Was I bringing Ugg over from Karak Hearn to help you out? Yes, but I don't remember exactly against what, because I'm not at war with the Talians. I think maybe I got peace with them. Was I at war with them at any point? What's our, what's our cooperative victory? Yeah, how close um, are we? we 56 out of 80. Right. So we need 24. another 24. And we both got to have 200... We got to have combined 200 units. Yeah. We've got 158, oh. so we need to put a few more armies. It's mainly tech we need to... <coughs> Sorry, yes, the tech was the... Catch you. up with. Yeah, the tech was the big one, because we needed... Was it 12 each, or...? Yes, so uh, I, I need four you, more. Yeah, excluding. You need, like, I, and I've more? only got five, yeah. I, so I need seven more. So I think so, that was the thing. That's basically it. So yeah, we just got to keep conquering territory, but most of it's been raised by Chaos. Right, that was um, the thing. We were racing against Chaos, who are now besieging Altdorf already, so that was the main thing, wasn't it? Yeah. Because um, you got to raise or conquer, and there's only a certain number we can conquer. I think... Oh, wow. We started the campaign before the Wood Elves were even released, I just realized. Um, Damn. <laughs> <laughs> that's a long time ago. Yeah, this is, we, I guess we must start this when King and the Warlord came out. Yeah. Uh, right, so I, I need to just... I need to probably just head into... 
Was it only was it it was raising counts as well, right? Yeah, I think that's what this plan. I just need to start going into like the Bretonian yeah. territory, start raising shit, just not even caring yeah. about taking raise, raise raise or conquer at least eighty different settlements. Yeah, all right, let's do that. I'm gonna jump over to Paravol and start murdering the empire. Why are you? Not? Are we? At, we're at war with the empire, aren't we? Or no? Uh, I'm not yet. I'm, I'm not. No, you're at war with Norm because you've uh, got a you've got a war right yes. next to Norm. Yeah, I had them attacking it. I think they. I don't know if they lost. They or had something. hit it before, actually. I think. Yeah. Because it looks like it's pretty broken. They've still got so a target on it. That one. I have a wow um, here, which could I could target on something. Why don't you go? Let's see. Go murder. I oh, don't mean having to declare war on people. Just go over to one Nolan as well, and then see what happens. Um, and then this army here, Gip Giblet, is. I guess I could attack Talia, but they are incredibly strong. I don't really want to. Um, but it does count for a bunch of regions, though, if I just raise Florak and stuff. So I guess, why don't we do this? Why don't you, you still send your Wa and your army over, and I'll have, yeah. I'll, I'll attack them in the west in Miragliano, and then you just, yeah. you take the towns out on the way there, as Florak and Mirmidens, etc. Is that a good idea? Yeah, cool. Okay, right, so yeah, I'll sounds good. cancel my Wa and just tell you to join with me. Clear the target, and then we'll just start sending you, um, it's the easiest way to travel, just fast forward this way. Okay, gonna get a move on here, and then I'll send my reinforcement army, which is being recruited right now over there as well. Noise. Okay, right. Um, I am gonna go broke very soon. That's okay. Uh, not very broke, so that's all right. Especially if you raid or um sack provinces before raising them, that'll help a little bit. Yep. I have an agent here, ornery. You're just doing your thing. Good. Oh, this is in the time where you didn't have to tell your agent to actually do something. He just, or where you did have to tell your agent to do something. In the new <laughs> game, in, in Warhammer 2, they just do it. You don't have to actually give them a, a deploy. Oh, um, the, the passive, yeah. Yeah. Alright, just come over here and check stuff out for me. Okay, good. Sounds fantastic. Uh, diplomacy, is there anything here that I need to look at? Nope. Everyone hates me except for you. Great. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to assume that I've done everything. I don't know what else there is. Actually, I suppose happiness, but quickly check my territories. Everyone's happy. Good. Good, good. And turn. Okay. Poor old Blorg. Rip. Rip a Rooney. Awa! Oh, what's this? Did my relations with the bloody hands. Or. Um, I'm going to say sod it and gain the treasury and ruin. Minus ten percent relations with you, because oh, uh, I'm breaking up with sorry, you. Not, sorry. Yeah, there, see, right, yeah. I'm gonna jump through the mountains down here, and then, yeah, attack Tilia. Uh, I was building some up over here. I'm guessing Artillery and I can get Black Orcs now, so I'm guessing this is gonna be my insane Black Orc crush army. So ah. let's let's do that. Um, how many Black Orcs is enough Black Orcs? I'm pretty sure about eight Black Orcs is, is enough Black Orcs. Orcs. Um, so yeah, that's, that's, that's that. Wait, um, what was that guy who just died? What was his name again? Blorg. Oh, it was Blorg. And these are Black yeah, Orcs. Blorg. They're in, in his name. They're Blorks. Black Orcs. Blorks. <laughs> right. Zufba, I am replenishing. I can go, yeah, I can go for Drakenhof once I replenish. That's fine. Right. Skarsnik. Take out Fort Oversire. Just order of that thing. Wagner. Lost no one. They had a wounded garrison. It. We must have attacked it before. Yeah. Oh, I'm tricky. Right, I can tell the war to hit that one. And then you guys, Gorefang, let's go kill those vamps. Yes. Stop running, Vladdy. Right, you get all resolved into the dust, you, you <laughs> dick. The <laughs> killing blog. Yeah, chinky. Get out of here, your glowy green blade. Um, what am I going to do? Uh, I'm going to eat them. Nom nom nom. Eat the dead things. That's 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 a good thing. Yeah, yeah it's healthy. Of course I'm it sure. is. Um, right, I can't encamp, so I'm just gonna move there to replenish a little bit. Uh, Grakadrin. 
Oh, you're only a few more turns away from your wyvern. I think that's why I was more upset about losing Blorg, because I think he was only like a turn or two away from his wyvern. Ah. Which would have been which would have been nice. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, Blorg. Sorry, Blorg. Right. Um, let me check if I've got any other armies about. Oh, Skarsnik's leveled up. The winds he's of, a dodgy geezer. The Winds of Magic in Eshin is tempestuous. Plus 50. That's insane. Oh, wow. Yeah. In Waldenhof as well. And in Essen. Um, all over the place. Uh, but, uh, Gorefang's over there. Muzrubs. Yeah, chilling. Uggs over there. And that's his army. And Nash. Yeah, you're just building up your army for now. So that's like all I can do. I've got like 8k coming in a turn. So I can keep Holy upgrading crap. things. If you need any money, let me know. The Bank of Lionheart is always open. <laughs> Well, actually, at some point I might do because I next turn I'm going to go start going negative income. Okay. Right. Um, oh, what's this agent doing? Oh, I was sending him over to see. Yeah, what? How far chaos was? Gone sour. Off you go. Oh, and I've got another one going this way as well. Grom. Grom. So you can see, is Altdorf going to survive? They, they should do. Uh, actually, yeah. Let me check my diplomacy. What? Like, who the hell am I at war with? Tulia, Vampire Counts, Wizen Land. Empire still has 11 settlements. They've taken over most of Bretonian territory. So, probably a good pl idea to declare war on them shortly. Yeah, I'm going to attack them. Because that'll get us 11. Yeah. Um, well, we won't be able to get all of them anymore, I don't think. But... The, the thing, if worse comes to worse, we're going to have to just go up against the scaling and hit all their settlements, which would just be a pain in the ass to get up there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but they've those. got some. Telia has got four. Estali has got five. So that plus the Empire's eleven will give us twenty. Vampire Council got three. There's Karak Siflin here. Got two or three. Yeah, they've got two. So as long as Chaos doesn't take out any more of the Empire territories, we'd be just okay without a need to go against the Varg and scaling. Yeah. Cool. Right. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be good. <laughs> Luckily, we have to. We've got quite a ways to go before the tech gets done, anyway. So we're, it's going to be yeah. a while, regardless. So we may, if we have to go up north, at least we have the time to do it, anyway. It's not like we'd be waiting yeah. for it. Oh my God, yeah, that's true. all the agents in our army in Castle Drakenoff, thats insane. I don't really understand why that's a victory objective. Like, research some tech, really? Yeah, yeah. it's a bit. Oh well, doesn't make much sense. Oh, that army oh, at least they moved that you. other full stack away. Yep. Yeah, I'll attack them, not coming to him, but next one after that, I think. Wow, another one. Nice. Ooh, for... Ooh, that's good. For my army next to Castle Temple off. I really needed that one, actually. Okay. Um, I think I'll... I'll stay on the old raiding camp, and I'll let my Wa get closer. And then you can attack it next turn or turn after or something. Cool. Yeah, Temple off's looking pretty weak. All right, I'm now minus income, but I should be okay for a long time. Do you time. want some? If you want some money, let me know. I will. I will yell when I need it. You'll be the first to know. <laughs> uh, okay, Manfred started recruiting a new army at Drakenhof. Truck, truck. All right, uh, this army is now done, so I can send this one over to work to Leia as well. Tilia. Let's jump over there. Nice. That's with Azak leading it as well. It's almost uh, minus or below 40 fighting this though, so I have to start fighting stuff soon. You are going to move right over here. Trust you get Grimgore as well. Uh, I don't recall. I don't think I did. I'm not sure. Uh, let me check. Let's recruit a new lord. Mm, yes, I did actually. Oh, but he was level 14. Oh, nice. I think he was leveled up. Yeah, 11 character skill. So he was a terrible general. Oh, all right. So I decided <laughs> not to use him for that reason. But yeah, I do have him if I want to. I might just uh, for at some point just uh, for why not sake. Yeah. Right, let's jump over to Paravon. Start murdering the Empire. It's, uh, it's about time to start doing that. So we'll do that next turn when we can attack them. This agent, why don't you go check out stuff around here? See how many easy towns there are to take. Probably all these Bretonian towns that the Empire has taken should all be pretty undefended. So except unless they've actually built walls, which unfortunately in Parvon they have, they should be pretty easy to take. Ooh, Leoness still alive. So that's a 
town or two that we can take from them. Nice. Um, so that's that army moved. We've moved this army. Spent money. Okay. I think that's good. Um, yep. Send that turn. Oh, my Y is attacking Castle Temple off. All right. Cool. I didn't tell them to do that, but sure, yeah. Good. Uh, Hopefully that counts as one of our raises, though, if they raise it. I think it m must do. Hope so. Well, I guess we'll find out. Uh, 58 now, so you have a gain 2. Did we destroy any other ones? Yeah, you destroyed Fort Orbis uh, yeah, Fort Orbistar and Castle Temple off, so that's 2. Unless you destroyed Walden off just then, or was that already destroyed? That was already destroyed, yeah. Okay, so yeah, that did count. Good. Yeah, I didn't do anything else. Okay. Okay. So I can send this guy over to Eshin. Um, Muzarab needs like one more turn to replenish. Skarsnik really needs some replenishment time. So let's get him into the raiding camp. For a bit. Uh, same with his dude. And let's br start bringing Gorfang back. There we go. All right, so that's those guys sorted for a little bit. Right, and let's go after these Delians. Bring the bad moon. Oh, you were already at war with them as well. Yarp. Ah, good. Oh, I think you brought me in. Yeah, and then I got pieces of them, I guess, because they were actually in my lands, and there's some. How it went for peace. Right, that's good. Another province right there. Oh, why is that not counted towards the total? Oh, I've done this already. Maybe we've done that one already. Maybe I've, I think so, actually. Yeah, but it's still yeah, fine. Yeah, I think you did. When they were still Empire, Border, Princes. Yeah. I guess. But this is still fine. We need to destroy these provinces anyway, and I could still use your help against the Stali at some point, so may as well yeah, keep going. Yeah, that's fine. I'll, I'll keep this guy down here to help you out. Yeah. Sounds good. All right. All right, guys, come on over there. Yeah, I think you've you've raised all of this stuff before, and they just pushed out and reclaimed it. Yeah, I and think everything. The border princes. I think actually their actual provinces, though, so Miragliano and Lucinia stuff, they should all be new. I don't think I did anything against them, but Myrmidons, cool. I think I have already raised before. It's okay. Right, that's all I can do. Was it in Warhammer 1, you were still able to both loot and raise in the same turn, right? Or was that not... Was that never an option? I don't remember. Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, Manfred's come to attack Oakenhammer. Oh. Okay, I can order his all that. All of his agents <laughs> versus my spears. Five goblins. Yeah, they, they can do they'd it. They'd probably... Yeah, their, their leadership would get wrecked. Yeah. <laughs> they actually did surprisingly high amount of damage to that necromancer. Yeah. Oh, he's going to sack it. it, which is fine, though, because he's going to get caught out now, and it means Mother Army can maybe move in, or I might just start sieging Drakenhof so that he can't get back in. Oh, that's not a bad idea. want peace with me, I'm going to decline that. Yeah. Who the because they're just about to be dead soon. Who the frick is Wissenland? Eldorf's holding a long time, being besieged by the uh, Chaos, so that's good. Oh, man, look at all these armies coming for you. Uh oh. <laughs> well, this might mean. Oh, where's my wa? Oh, never mind. They're right there. I'm blind. <laughs> Where my wa? Where's my wa? This means that I should probably actually go after them. I can't reach them though, because I could attack Miligliano right now, but then obviously they'll just turn around and besiege Saragzil. So I don't know how useful that would really be. Um, you say you probably can't push into Miligliano yet. No, I have to besiege it for a while, unless you. So you get another in. army over there. Yeah. Um, I hmm, yeah, where are they gonna go? Things they could bring both those armies back to attack you. Yeah, you've got your war with you. Yeah, so I'm not really worried say... about it, but I'm, I'm more worried about the, the fact that that'll destroy Zaraxil, which would be kind of annoying. 
Um, I could wait one turn until they're further away. You attack them with your Y, your army, and then I'll attack Merigliano. They are recruiting um, stuff right wait, now. It's gonna be my turn. It's gonna be my turn next, isn't it? Yeah. I reckon they'll still keep coming for me. Because you can't, you can't save Zorak still anyway, can you? Uh, well, if you kill those armies, then obviously it'll be fine. I don't think I can reach them this, okay. this turn. So I could, I'll, I think I'll wait one turn, and then you can join me in Miragliano, so I don't have to siege him for a while. Well, if only level two, I'd, I'd say go for Miragliano, and just let your war catch up with you, because then you can wipe it out next turn. Okay. Should I call you into the war against the Empire? Uh, yeah, go for it. Alright. They've got Bretonia joining them. So Bretonia is still alive too, which is good. What? Oh, right. This oh, is, good. Yeah. More settlements. <laughs> oh, God, I have to actually besiege this for a while. Okay, what else yeah, can I Yeah, probably only until your war shows up. Oh, hold on. Never mind. Um, hold on, hold on. Uh, Ta-da! There's my other army. So I think I'll wait, because if they actually, yeah, if they attack with both those armies against my one army, I may have some trouble. But if I wait one turn, they'll go towards you, then I'll jump towards you as well, with my army that just arrived. Next is what I well, it's a little further away, but I should be able to get there. Well, I can probably force march next to your army. Oh, that would work too, yeah. So, still, still attack Miragliano, oh, well, and here, here, watch, follow you up. Here's what you'll do. Um, move up to my army. It, force march up to my army and then call me into the war and then actually yeah fuck it i'll just attack him now it makes more sense yeah Midigliano, screw you because if they go back if they go to zaraxil then they're trapped in the mountains then we can just move on them anyway yeah i guess that's fine too oh my word then your war will follow you next turn hopefully and be in range be in range if not you can just keep sieging that until our other two armies uh, are done with their armies out here on the field and then we can just reinforce you it's about 99 percent in their favor right now yeah so that's good <laughs> Uh, okay, so that army's there. Um, you are... I don't know what you're doing. Let's just clear your target, because you're not actually besieging Milne anymore, so come back to me. Um, army here, right. So my army next to Castle Tempelhof. What the hell should I do with you guys? Um, I guess I should start moving them towards Castle Tem Drakenhof. I'll move 50% and then encamp, and then I can get there next turn. And I also could use some money now from you, I think. If you have some spare. Actually, you know what? Screw it. I'll cancel a building. You. Go away. Alright. Actually, it's been 30 minutes. Uh, we should probably end it on your turn then. Yep. I'll end my turn. Oh, I have a commandment available. Let's see. Let's do... Uh, extortion rates. No, I'll go for happiness, actually. Alright. Awesome, my turn. But we will save that for the next episode. So, guys, um, yeah, next episode should happen. <laughs> should be out very soon. Um, because, yeah, we're going to be bolt recording this. And if not, well, the next episode will be us eating some socks, which we really, neither of us want to do. And also that means either Donkey's got to get a plane ticket or I do. And I don't really want to do that. No. Um, so, yeah, there's going to be more of this series <laughs> very soon. <laughs> Until then. One. Bye. Ciao for now.